Hey everybody, it's Kathy, and today I'm sharing five everyday legging outfits for an apple body shaped woman. I'm going to be using one pair of leggings and creating five outfits from clothes that I already own in my closet. Most of the pieces are still available, so everything will be linked in the description box. Hopefully these outfits can give you some inspiration. So I'm using one pair of leggings and the leggings are from Talbots. They are part of the T by Talbots line and they are their everyday stretch leggings. I like them because they are high waisted. They're very comfortable. They're not constricting. They're available in petite and plus petite. And that is what I am wearing is the plus petite because I'm five foot four. They are made from 89% cotton, 11% spandex. Right now they're available in the colors navy and black, but there are many other different variations of this legging available. So my very first outfit, I am wearing the navy leggings by Talbots. Like I said, I really love them. They're high-waisted. They're so comfortable. I can wear them all day, and honestly, they just feel like second skin to me. Have you ever worn leggings where by the end of the day you just can't wait to take them off because you know they're uh, digging into you? These are not like that. Honestly, they're the most comfortable leggings that I've ever worn. And Buddy, my cat, agrees with me. So this very first outfit is a very casual outfit. Um, this is something that I would wear if I was exercising or just say hanging around the house for the day. So I'm wearing the leggings. I have them paired with some slip-on bionic shoes. I love bionic shoes because if you are like me and you have flat feet and you need arch support, these shoes are great because they have great supportive uh, footbeds and the, the soles are very supportive as well. I'm also wearing a pink t-shirt by Caslon and I find that they fit a little on the larger side I think the one that I'm wearing right now is an XL. I do have the XXL. It's just a little too big for me. So just be aware of that. These t-shirts come in a variety of different colors and they're great for spring and summer and also for layering. And then I'm topping everything off with this new hoodie that I got from Talbots. It is so slimming, kind of a dressy hoodie. It's lightweight and I like that it covers my butt. I hate it when you get those hoodies, you know, when they cut your butt in half or they stop above the butt, because that just brings attention right to my problem area and also my stomach. Okay, so let's start showing you the leggings. You can see that they're high-waisted. I'm five foot four with a 27 inch inseam. These are the plus petite. So the length is really perfect for me. And there's the slip-on bionic shoes. Love these shoes. And the thing that I like about Talbots as well is that their colors, from my understanding, I could buy something a year from now, and as long as it's in the same color, like say indigo blue, which I believe is the color of this, it's going to match. But just to show you, I believe the proper color of the, the leggings are navy, but I know they're two different blues, but they do go nicely together. So here's the hoodie. It has two front pockets. It's a longer length hoodie, which I like. Show you the hood. It has ties. It zips all the way up. And I like that it covers my butt. And it falls below the hip and the arm length is perfect. I'll put the size below. I can't remember if this is a plus petite or a plus, but it fits me like a glove. And then underneath it, I'm just wearing this pink cast on tee. And it's just a nice exercise or around the house outfit. And then for jewelry, I have this little stretch bracelet set that I got from Talbot's. I think in December or last fall, they're still available. They're just super cute. I think they also come in gold, but I'm not sure if the gold's still available, but I know that these are. And I'm just wearing some silver hoops. And for those of you that are interested, my makeup today is actually the Taizo uh, Mineral Sunscreen. It Cosmetics Brow Pencil. 
Too Faced Mascara, It Cosmetics Lipstick, and then I just put some Clear Lip Gloss over that by Charlotte Tilbury. Oh, and I'm wearing Charlotte Tilbury bronzer all over my face. So my second outfit wearing the same leggings, I put on this beautiful bateau neckline medallion tee that I recently picked up at Talbot's. It has three quarter length sleeves. It fits true to size. I would say it's a more fitted fit top. I just love blue. It's one of my favorite colors and I love the pattern. I think it's flattering and I'm going to be wearing it under a hoodie that I'll show you, but I just wanted to show you the tee first. For jewelry, I'm wearing this beaded bracelet that I had bought on Amazon. It has an evil eye, very reasonably priced. For shoes, I'm wearing a brand new pair of shoes that I got a week ago and they're birdies. They are the most comfortable shoes I think I've ever worn. They're slip-on shoes. These particular ones are, I think they're navy. I'll look it up and then I'll put it in the description box. Either navy or black, but they're velour, and inside is quilted. It's so supportive. They're lovely. Now, I have a size 10 wide foot. They're a bit snug when I first put them on, but then it almost like just melts around your foot, and they're just so cushiony and so comfortable. I really do love them. So I think this is like a nice dressy casual look. I would have no problem wearing this out to, to a restaurant or invited out to friends. I just find that this top makes it the whole outfit look a little more dressy. So it's a casual. I like that the top covers most of my butt. I just love blue and the colors for the spring are so beautiful. I'm just waiting for Talbots to have a sale so I can place another big order because the colors are beautiful. Typically I don't like a three quarter length sleeve. I would prefer a full length. So that's why I put some bracelets on. I do like wearing bracelets, so I guess it's just a, a little bit of a way to dress up the arm. And the shoes, again, they're, aren't they cute? They come in a variety of different colors. They're so comfortable. I definitely want to pick up a few more colors. So I just put the hoodie over this. I just wanted to show you what it looked like. This would be great for in the spring. It's still pretty cold here, but whenever we get warmer days, in the late spring, you know, if I'm going out to run errands or whatever. I just think this is a cute look. And again, the column of color, slimming, hopefully makes me look a little bit taller than I am. I don't know who is texting me, but it always happens when I film. So yeah, this is my outfit. So for this outfit, it's a little more dressy. You might remember this top from my Talbot's haul. I said that I was going to send it back. I thought about it. A lot of you said to keep it. And then the more I thought about it, the way I'm going to style it, I think that I will like it. Um, it has sort of a, a little V-neck, which is flattering. At first, I wasn't sure about the smocked cuffs but they're kind of growing on me and I think that they add a little bit of a feminine touch to the top. Again, it's blue, I love blue. It has a lovely pattern and whenever you have a larger belly, you have to be careful with the patterns you choose. And I think that this one is flattering because it's not like huge, um, say like palm trees or big, big, big flowers. Now I know the top before the medallion one, some people are going to say, but it has a big pattern. It does, but I like it and I think it's flattering. Like these style tips, they're just to be taken with a grain of salt. You don't have to adhere to them 100% of the time. It's just like, if you're looking for tips, how to look smaller, like there's basic guidelines. But if you find a piece of clothing that you love and it doesn't fit into any of the tips or hacks, it's fine. The whole point is to find clothes that fit your body that you feel comfortable wearing. That's the whole point. Because with plus size clothing, and I believe plus size is anything above a size 12 or 14, it's difficult to get nice looking clothes sometimes. Like they, they just seem to um, not care about that whole demographic of women. So I'm excited whenever I can find 
clothes that are great for plus size women are women that have an apple shape because it can be really difficult to find flattering clothes and especially when you are petite and petite I'm talking about your height, 5'4 and under. So I decided to keep this top because I do think it will go nice with jeans, but I wanted to show you what it looks like with the leggings alone. And then I'm going to show you um, how I'm gonna style it with a cardigan. So because I have the smocked cuffs, I'm not wearing any bracelets. I'm just keeping the same hoops in for the whole video just to show you how changing your top or your shoes can just give you a totally different look with leggings. So the thing, one of the things that I like about this top is the length. I like that it comes below the crotch on me. I'm 5'4". Uh, the same in the back, it covers most of the butt. And I like that it has this kind of scooped split hem on the sides. You can see that the arm length is perfect. I'm not sure if this is a plus or a plus petite. I will put the size uh, in the description box. I think it looks like a nice outfit. And I have it paired with those same birdie uh, velour shoes. You know, I could see myself wearing runners with this. If you wanted a dressier look, you could wear a little heel. It's just so versatile. That's what I love about these leggings, that they can be dressed up or you can wear them for exercise. Personally, I won't exercise in these. I have another pair from Talbots that I like for exercise, but I wanted these for dress up. And typically I would go with black, but I'm trying to be more daring, so I went with navy. Personally, I like to always go dark on my bottom and then have a pop of color on the top, but that's just my personal choice. But let me show you what this outfit looks like styled with a cardigan. I'm wearing a shaker, I think it's a shaker knit cardigan that I got from Talbots and you have to take a look at this cardigan. I think it's like in five or six different colors. They are gorgeous. There's beautiful green, a peach color. They're just gorgeous. And I know the cardigan is a little shorter. I typically like a longer cardigan, but I think that this is kind of trendy for spring. Not that I follow the trends, but I just think it's a nice look. The cardigan is going to go nice with jeans or dress pants, but I just wanted to show you what it looked like with this top. I won't button the cardigan, but it does have buttons and the sleeves are turned up. And again, I'm not sure if it's a plus or a plus petite, but I'll tell you in the description box. So I think it's just a, a nice look for spring. And again, this would look really nice with jeans and I will be doing a jeans video. Do you wanna see a jeans video, how to style jeans for an apple body shape? Let me know in the description box. One of the criticisms that I had when I first tried this top on was this. <laughs> it's still driving me nuts. But one of you nice ladies told me that I could get some fashion tape and I think that's what I'm gonna do is just get some off of Amazon. I'm just going to tuck this part and then I think it will be a much better look and I'll feel more comfortable in it if it's like that. It's just these little things. I wish they would have like notched them out. But yeah, it's cute and surprisingly I changed my mind and uh, I'm keeping it. And for shoes, I'm still wearing the birdies. I could wear this outfit with runners. If I wanted to dress it up, I could have a little shoe with a heel. I just think that these leggings are so versatile and so comfortable. That's why I really do love them. So this outfit is super casual. And what I have done, I put on a white cast on t-shirt and I've just thrown a plaid shirt over it and left it open. This is typically not an outfit that I would wear, but I kind of like the look. It's kind of just fun looking. Now, a little tip, if you're big busted like me and you have a blouse, a button up blouse that, you know, you don't feel comfortable wearing because it pulls there, or just wear it open and it's just a really nice look. 
This is a Rails plaid shirt that I bought in the Nordstrom sale a couple years ago. I will link some more budget-friendly options in the description box. And the tee is just a Caslon, just wearing the same hoops and no other jewelry. And I'm wearing the Vionic slip-on shoes. So I find this t-shirt is really long, but instead of tucking it in, what I will do is I'll just pull it up a little bit and just kind of, you know, fold it over it like that, just so it drapes a little bit over the belly, but I wouldn't wear it like tight down like when I first showed you. And then for the sleeves on this, what you could do is unbutton them and then just turn them up a couple of times to where you're feeling comfortable and it just gives a, a different kind of a vibe I guess. So this is kind of like a cute outfit too for wearing around the house or if you're running errands and I'm wearing the Vionic slip-ons. I love these shoes. You know, I don't have a lot of shoes, but the ones that I do have, I really love. And if you see me wearing them over and over again, that's why. Because I have like wide, flat feet with a high instep. And I really need support. And it's difficult for me to find shoes that are slip-ons that my instep will go in. And I haven't found very many pair of dress boots that my feet will fit properly in because of the high instep. So if you know of any brands that are great for high end steps, please let me know. So that's this outfit. So this outfit, I'm actually wearing a plaid shirt that I bought in the fall. And I wanted to show you this outfit to show you what I was talking about earlier about their colors always matching. This is from Talbot's. And I know that this is on major sale today because I looked before filming this video, maybe 60% off. Don't quote me, but I know it's on sale. And they do have plus sizes still available. But I really like this top because you know I love blue and pink. And it has two of my favorite colors in it. But it's just kind of a nice fun plaid for, you know, fall, winter. It's super cute. I'm still wearing the same bionic shoes. Um, same leggings, but I just wanted to show you the top part. It covers the bottom. It may also be available in a different color. And then I'm going to show you what it looks like with this hoodie. So I just threw on the hoodie and I think this is a really cute look. Same leggings, same shoes. If you enjoyed this video, you might also enjoy my 2023 fashion trends that are awful for petite plus size women. And be on the lookout. I'm coming out with a trends video in the next week or two fashion trends for 2023 that are perfect for petite plus size women. If you want to see more outfit inspiration videos, be sure to let me know in the comments. I'll see you over at the other video. Bye.